hi welcome back to my channel i hope you all had an amazing day um today is another too good to go haul uh if you like these kind of videos i'd love it if you hit the like button and subscribe that'd be brilliant um and let's get into it first things first today i went to co-op again co-op is a staple for me it's right around the corner so very often when i do these i do go to the co-op because they're, they're usually quite good so let's have a look what we've got here oh wow okay we have got a naked beef burrito bowl for two. Oh wow that looks good you've got a it's got yeah i've never ever seen one of these before no but i definitely want to try that Definitely. It's quite nice, actually. It does. It does. It. You can smell it. It smells lovely. Right. Let, what else have we got? What's this? Oh, spinach and pine nut pasta. That's Ew. quite nice. Ew. Oh, yeah. I don't. Lucy, Lucy doesn't like it. I don't like pasta. Lucy is behind the camera again. Always. She, she doesn't like pasta. I'll, I'll admit I'm not a fan, but I'm sure one of the boys will enjoy that. And then last but not least, we've got, oh, Piri Piri, Piri Chicken Mini fit Fillets. They'd be nice. I'll enjoy them. I'm, I'm nicking those. <laughs> They're mine. So I haven't had my tea yet and I'm starving. So, yeah, I, whatever I'm having, I'm having it with the Piri Piri Chicken Fillets. Unless, of course, we find something better. Right, so that was everything in the, um, oh, co-op too good to go bag that's that's not bad i'm quite impressed with that yeah that that's yeah really impressed with that that one was three pound 29 so yeah that's that one next i went to costa this one is i believe this is three pounds i think it's either three pounds or three pounds 29 um but yeah so first things first what did we get oh Two amazing massive croissants. Dibs. Excellent. All right, Lucy's dibs those. No, I did one of them. You I'm not that one. Lucy. Yeah. Oh yeah, they're nice because croissants obviously they can be kept till the next day. What's this? We've got oh free range egg mushroom and spinach bap. Nice. Nice. I'm pretty sure. My Christopher will enjoy that. He loves anything with egg and mushrooms and things like that in. What's this? Oh, my favourite. We've got another cheddar and roasted tomato sandwich. I do enjoy those. They are really nice. And last but not least, we've got... Oh, we've got another vegan barbecue chicken panini. We always get these. I haven't told the boys yet that they're vegan. So they, they're not quite sure. They think it tastes a bit funny, but they do eat it. You know, so we just keep that quiet between us. But yeah. So yeah. I think it's ah, nice. That's not bad. Not bad at all for that. Yeah. Thoroughly impressed with that. Now this one is a new one to me. This is Morrison's Market Kitchen. It's where they do like their hot food. So yeah, right, all new to me. I think this one was... I think it might have been $3.99. I think it might have been $3.99, this one. So let's have a look. I, I have no idea what this is. So let's open it up and have a look. I'll be honest, it looks like it might be some sort of jacket potato. But we'll have a look. Oh, wow. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, yes. Are you going to have that with the said? I'm going to have it with the, the piri piri chicken, I think. One jacket potato. What's this one? Oh, we've got some corn on the cob. Lucy's going to nick, nick them, and I expect one of the boys will nick them. My Matthew will probably have that. What's this? I have no idea. No idea. There's no markings to give me any indication of what it might be. But it feels heavy. Oh, it's a wrap of some sort. I have no, I don't know what's in it. I have no idea. It smells like, I'll be honest, right? It smells like a kebab. 
but I can't I can't tell what's in it. Crystal loves like those. Yeah. Things. Yeah. But it, it smells like a Donna kebab. I'll be honest. Yeah, someone's gonna whip that off of me, I'll tell you, pretty sharpish. I'll let you know, I'll pin a comment and let you know what was in it. Because I don't know right now. Oh, this is heavy. Oh, look at this. What is it? We've got a bag of chicken drumsticks. No wonder my dog, he's decided to try and join us. Can they see him? Yeah, they can. Yeah. He's, he can obviously smell the chicken drumsticks. He suddenly perked up. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, that, for less than £4, that's impressive. I'm, I am impressed with that. I will be going there again. That is... That is so good. Everything. And it's all hot, ready to ready to eat. I think it's the stuff that they made that day and then, like, haven't been able to sell. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's exactly what it is. Because yeah. that's what Too Good To but Go is. Because it's, like, made that day and it's fresh, it's quite good. Yeah. But, yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. I will definitely be trying to get my hands on one of them more often. Um, yeah, very, very, very impressed with that. Yeah, we got quite a haul here this week. Um, yeah. What we don't eat right now, I will freeze. The hot stuff obviously needs to be eaten straight away. But the burrito pan, I had a look. And I believe I can stick that in the freezer. Um, so yeah, what's not eaten now will be either eaten tomorrow or frozen and heated up another day. So yeah, very impressed. Um, that's it for this video. Uh, if you like it, I'd love it if you'd hit the like button. Um, subscribe to my channel. I'm actually looking into doing some mystery boxes. Um, they've got some on Woucher that um, uh, they're like uh, all different bits and pieces in there. I thought I might get one and have a little gander and see what's in one of those and maybe have a look on eBay or Etsy for another one and just yeah just because I'm curious and this gives me a reason to buy one. But that's it for now. Uh, I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.